Hello everyone, in this video I'll be doing a review of the G Fuel Energy Drink in the Dragon Fruit flavor. This is Spyro the Dragon, so it's pretty cool. There's only 140 milligrams of caffeine per can, so it's a little bit less than some of their 300 milligram ones. And yeah, I'm excited to try this out. I'm assuming it's going to taste like dragon fruit, as it's called dragon fruit. <laughs> so we'll get into it, review the flavor. This increases your energy, focus, endurance, and reaction time. Let's get into it. It's just caffeine. No, ca no carbs, no sugar, no protein, no fat. Okay, it smells interesting. Let's get into it. Hmm. It does taste like dragon fruit, but it's not like super strong. I've had other dragon fruit flavor like supplements and energy drinks in the past, and they've usually had a stronger dragon fruit flavor than this, but it's still pretty good. There is a uh, Red Bull dragon fruit. I think it comes in a green can, and it's really intense with its flavoring, whereas this one's a bit more mild. It's good though. It has that classic G Fuel taste to it, so it's like, if you've had G Fuel drinks before, you'll know what I'm talking about. I don't know how to describe it, but it has its own distinctive taste. It does taste like very diluted dragon fruit. It's still pretty good though. I'm sure this is one that'll grow on me as I drink it a bit more and more. Um, it's a pretty decent flavor though, dragon fruit. <laughs> It's kind of like sweet like pears, um, a little tiny bit citrusy almost, like grapefruit, wheat monster type vibe. For those of you that never had dragon fruit before, I guess it's the best way to put it. It's kind of, kind of like sweet like a pear with a bit of citrusiness to it. I don't really know how else to describe it, but it's a pretty good flavor and it's not too intense. So if you're not like a big fan of dragon fruit or any type of fruit like that, you're not going to be like grossed out by this, I don't think. So... The G Fuel Energy Drink Dragon Fruit Flavor on scale 1 to 10. I give it a comfortable 7, maybe 7.5 out of 10. It is a pretty decent flavor, but again, it's not too intense with its flavors or anything, so it's a nice mild one if you are unsure if you like this. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.